Hi, my name is Don Briggs and I'm a member of the team at Breadboard Electronics and this is project number 12 based on our starter kit. This is a simple delay timer. Uh, again, based on capacitance and the easiest way to show you is to show you. We've just turned that on, it's charging that up and it is now fully charged. Now, just in case there was some residual charge in there from when I was using it just now, if I reset it with this push switch, it will charge up and then light the LEDs. Turn, turn SW1 off and that's it, the power's gone. Now, if you change the value of that capacitor there, like I've got here, it says to a thousand microfarad, it would extend the delay period before the lights start to glow. Now, there are lots of applications for this. Um, as a trigger switch on door or window, a pressure mount, or anything along those lines. Again, quite simple but quite effective. <coughs> and a breadboard layout. I've used a couple of off-board switches here because it's starting to look a bit busy on the circuit, it's a circuit board itself. So, again, we start it running. That the power is already in. Uh, lights have just lit up so we restart it by resetting the capacitor and slowly slowly they all pop back on flick the main switch and they will just all slowly go off with the discharge of the capacitor again very very simple that's the end of project 12 thank you for watching this is project 12 simple timer uh, this is a very, very simple transistor timer, and it's largely based around the value of that capacitor. Uh, I'll, to explain, it's easier to show you. So if I turn that on, the, the LEDs will slowly illuminate, and that's based on the value of that capacitor. If you increase it or decrease it, it will change the time between you turning it on and the LEDs coming up. Um, this obviously is a switch in this circuit just to, so we can prove the circuit but that could be a micro switch, a pressure switch or any any kind of switch. Uh, and if you push this button here which is a reset button it starts the cycle again and again it gives you a few seconds. Like I say by changing the value of that capacitor up or down it will change uh, the amount of times the amount of time it takes for the LEDs to light up. That's the end of Project 12. Thank you very much.